Hey guys, it's Valib here. Today we're going to do an unboxing of Lilliput's new 4K broadcast monitor, the A12. Um, so this just came out and I'm really excited because I've been looking for a broadcast monitor for a while that had four HDMI inputs so I could connect all my cameras and watch them at once for live events and things like that. Um, and the cheapest one uh, that I could find was around $900,000. And that was, um, I believe that was also Lilliput. So this one is a 10 inch monitor uh, and it comes in around $600. And it is great. I mean, the specs wise, it's great. Um, and it does 4K, it, you can double it as a director's monitor or something like that. Um, so let's take a look at, at what's really in here. So right here you have the user manual. And right here, there you go, that's it. Let me open this up. I have to say, holding this for the first time, it is very light. Um, of course, it doesn't have a battery on here, but it is as light as my regular seven inch monitors. Um, and this does 4K. Um, this has four HDMI inputs on the bottom, a display port in, um, you have earphones, your uh, power, uh, and SDI in and out. You have uh, hot shoe mounts, or sorry, not hot shoe, um, you have your threads uh, on all four sides. You have your four buttons on the top. One counts for power uh, as well as changing the input. Um, you have your two function buttons, and then this is just like an exit, I guess. And then you have a dial for using your menu. Um, and. Quality feels great. Uh, the, this entire uh, bezel is uh, metal, and the back is plastic, but uh, it, you know it seems pretty solid still. Um, one thing to note is I don't know if you can see it at this angle, but this is the screen right here, and this is just a bezel. At least it looks like that. I'll have to turn it on and test it. Um, but yeah, this whole thing doesn't look like it's the screen, so. Um, I'm gonna do a full in-depth review on this um, soon. I think I'll make two videos, one like just an overview, uh, and then later on I'm gonna you know, test the hell out of this thing. So stay tuned for that. Um, the review I'll post right here, so definitely check that out, and I'll see you in the next one. Oh yeah, and by the way, uh, I forgot to actually unbox the rest of it, so in case you care, um, you know, inside the box, we have a bunch of other stuff. This is your power cable right here. You get an HDMI to mini HDMI cable. Um, I don't really know what this is. Could be a stand. And, oh, this looks like um, a sunshade, which is nice. I didn't even know that was included. And then you got three, oh, this is just to cover up these holes, I guess. I don't know why you would need to do that, but it's there. And then we have a nice little box here. It's something, ah, these are just your tools, and it comes with a ball head, which is nice. Um, I still don't know what this is. If somebody knows, let me know. Seems like some sort of, oh, this could be a plate for um, mounting uh, Anton Bauer or V-mount batteries. That's probably what this is. So that's it for the unboxing. And then, you know, go to the next video. See ya.